Okay, so, vibrating object. What do you think is going to happen if I stick it in there? Do. Gonna splash in his face. All right. So. All right. Let's give it a try. Right. Pay attention. You're watching. You're watching. You're watching. Okay. Bam. Vibrate. Ready? You ready? You ready? <laughs> My major is jazz composition. Music therapy. Bass performance major. Music therapy. It's music education. The jazz composition. Music business major. And music production and engineering. This work study position has definitely improved my professionalism. Obviously, when you teach something, you reinforce that in yourself. I'm trying to figure out different ways to teach the kids. I've actually learned better ways to practice myself. I believe that you don't actually know what you know really until you teach it to someone. I get to take what I've learned in my music education classes and I'm able to teach young ladies music. Living in Boston is not it's not cheap whatsoever. So all my money is dumped towards a uh, electric bill. Groceries a lot for the tea pass. The paycheck is great. It changed the even my parents way of thinking about me because now I could apport uh, support myself. It really helps me pay my bills and my parents are glad because they don't have to pay for them. It basically makes it a lot easier just to, so I don't have to use my loans so much. I'm getting paid 10 25 an hour which is incredible, especially in an economy like this. The neighborhood network we've created of public schools and community-based organizations is it's their workshop where they learn to engage and perfect their leadership skills. I have a work-study position at Hyde Square Task Force, and um, there I'm employed as a vocal instructor. I've honestly never been in this position before to teach. So it's yeah, because we already eight. did the four, so okay. let's do the eight again. Okay. Okay, so in for four and out for eight. Well, on a professional level, this is really good experience for me to teach. I get to make some money through student employment, which is great, through the college, but the best part is the fact that I get to teach students. So I'm actually just like defining my skills and like getting better at what I do, and that's great, and I do it while like listening to some music that's incredible from kids that are having like hard times at home or at school. I give guitar lessons to students between the ages of 6 and 12. The kids are just incredible, and it's just a great experience for me. He's going to be 13 Friday and he's already learning modes and he can already read music. He's learned the difference between major and minor and learning all the seven chords. At my job at Young Achievers, I have been able to use everything that I've learned in the classroom in my music ed, uh, classes. Since I've used them, I've been doing so well in, in my tutoring position that I've been able to branch out to meet the music teacher and assist him with different things. I love coming to work every day and seeing the kids waiting for me and their faces light up when they get a chance to play guitar, drums, and work with Berkeley Work Study students. We come to the Blue Hill Boys and Girls Club at the Music Club. Hi, my name is um, Rick Agler. I'm the Music Clubhouse Director here at the Blue Hill Boys and Girls Club. Rick, the director of the Music Clubhouse, he said... The teacher. The teacher, whatever. I've worked here since... Officially since September 2007 as a full-time director, but I've volunteered and worked here actually as a Berkeley work study for three years ago I started. So we spent a better part of two years trying to build a full-time program here. I take piano lessons and sometimes I could play drums and guitar. I play trumpet lessons, piano, and guitar lessons. So what is it? Okay. You guys want to dance it? When it comes up? What makes this music clubhouse special is because we get opportunities to play instruments and some kids don't have those opportunities. So how do I get a copy? What's up? What's up? <laughs> I couldn't be any happier or blessed or lucky to have this position. I love it. It's awesome. It's great. Thank you, Berkeley. It's because boys said we're supposed to be dancers or something like that yeah. out in the world. And they think and they think girls can't do what boys do. So uh, let's say we have a vocal here. Um, I got 
I think this vocal sticks out a little bit much when it comes to So see how loud those are? But they might have been good in this other section. Berkeley Work Study students benefit from this partnership and the fact that they gain valuable leadership skills um, as well as organizational skills as far as uh, following a lesson schedule, being committed and being there on time. Um, these are really valuable job skills that everybody needs to learn. My students were amazed at the capabilities of the Berkeley College of Music students and how they were able to engage them. We had a dream that we wanted to have a place in the community where our young people could come and express themselves through music, through dance, through poetry. And today is a very emotional day for us because we actually realized our, our dream. I also would like to say thank you to uh, the Berkeley School of Music who is our um, wonderful, wonderful partner that provides us with work study students and provides wonderful staff and community relations. And we have two people here, Jim McCoy and Curtis Warren. I really want to thank them because without their partnership and help, we also would be able to run this program. is because of Berkeley School of Music. Now, unless we have systems that allow all these kids to perfect their sports skills, to learn their dancing skills, to perfect their music skills, or to, to, to at least even pick up an instrument to get started, they're not going to wind up in those institutions no matter how much we want them to. So it's the work we do in the community that really results in the, the yield at the end. So it's essential that Berkeley did this, and I really appreciate uh, the investment. That a lot of what we're doing, particularly in the audio music area, we would not be able to accomplish without the work of the students. The Berkeley students who are participating in the Community Service Work Study Program are the most empowered group of young people I've ever seen anywhere. And what this program has done, and what the people here have done, is they've opened the windows and replace the sound of gunfire with the sound of music. Yeah.